So I've seen a handful of comments from people saying that on their Duo after the 12L update that their notification shade is like super narrow, like weirdly narrow. If you look at what it's supposed to look like, I'll just show you what it's meant to look like. When you pull down a notification, I don't have any notifications. I need to like send myself something. Basically the notifications that will be the same width as this here. Let me send myself like a text message. Okay, you can see here uh, what that width is supposed to be. I've seen people saying that theirs is like super skinny and I, I don't have, didn't have an answer for them on this. However, I just got this comment here from, where did it go? Randy Johnson, I'm assuming not the baseball player, who said that apparently this is something to, I cannot highlight this text for anything. We're just going to have to roll with it. He says, for anyone that has the narrow pull down notification issue, check to see what your font and display settings are at. Large works for both. If you go to the largest it will wreck your notification pull down. So let's test this. So we're gonna go on font size largest, and then we're gonna go on to display size largest. And let's see, there we go. It has actually screwed up my, <laughs> my casting, hold on. You can't see what I just saw. Let's try this again. There we go. That has caused that to shrink down now i don't know for sure if all the people that i've seen post this if this has been their problem or not if this is where their settings are i don't know uh honestly why you would want your settings to be set like this maybe you just have visual problems and that would be a problem if you need it to be this well you've got a problem at that point let's put the font size back down to default and we still have the tiny notification shade so this makes me wonder if this is a DPI issue. Here's what I would suggest. If you have this issue, go into these settings under display, font and display size, and I've wrecked it again, and put them back at default. And I'd be willing to bet that's gonna fix your problem, or at least it's gonna fix it for some people. So short video, shout out to Randy here for pointing this out. I, I think this is gonna help some people though. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.